you know, the view is just so absolutely ridiculous. Barbara Walters is rolling over in her grave. The whole thing is such a ridiculous farce. But for some reason, a certain set of people pay attention to it. And I would like to wake up those people. And it's also on at the exact time as us right now, which I take a certain pleasure in. Um, but Sonny Hostin, who I think is genuinely the most unlikable person on television. And as I said, Joy Reid is on television. So that's a hell of a freaking statement for me to make. She got into it with Alyssa Farah. Now, Alyssa Farah is the quote unquote conservative at the table. So you've got, you know, four lefties basically, and then like a pet conservative. And they got into a, a fight that I just think is so like emblematic of everything wrong with television and media and politics and the whole damn thing. Take a look. I think he wants power. I think he wants so much power that in 2017, he closed public beaches to all of New Jersey, except for his family and his son, so he could have his son's birthday party on the beach. I think he thinks How does he get special. power by entering think, the race? Though, I think he thinks he's he special. But what can't scares win. me, yeah. Alyssa, is that you are incapable of defending a man that you worked for, that you I know am not, of. Oh, no, no. Why don't you, you ask me a question rather than... You're saying that you than, need to hear... I did ask you a question. She oh, did. I had a point and, I wanted and, you, to and you said that you needed to hear more from him. And I don't need to hear more from Pence for several reasons. Because when I lived well, in Well, you just Indian, accused me of something, so why don't you let me actually answer? You're not going to no, vote for a Republican no, ever. No, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna to finish what I'm going to say. Um, the thing about Pence here is that when I lived in Indiana and I went to Notre Dame, he had a terrible appro approval rating because of the way he treated the AIDS crisis. Awful. Uh, a lot of people died because of him. A lot of people died because of how he handled the COVID crisis. He I mean, was you, actually, you defended Cornell West speaking, yesterday, I'm who still, would destroy I'm our still country. Speaking. So. He also um, was a parrot for Trump. Don't he make this personal. Let's hear. He yeah, spearheaded the, the, the Trump. Sonny likes to make it personal with me, so we'll just. He's, well, like, are you going to give me a chance to answer? Speaking the truth. Spearheading troop, uh, Trump's yeah, COVID I mean, this is absurd. agenda. <laughs> of downplaying the virus. Well, this you, is not what then, the show is about. This is Barbara it's Walters' everybody, legacy. It's everybody's, everybody's view. It's everybody's, it's everybody's view. view. It's everybody's view. view. And Penn oh, Okay. Yeah, Ashley. <laughs> Like, like this, like I can feel like a tumor growing in my I brain. I hate you, Dave, for <laughs> but, uh, I, like, Yeah, I apologize that. to you guys. I apologize to everyone watching. I apologize to my team here. Why would I do this to any of us? Liz, it's interesting because, look, Alyssa is obviously well compensated. And again, she's just getting exactly what they pay her for. But someone like you could sit in that seat, right? Like you, you, would, you would knock it out of the park, which is why they'd never hire you for that. Uh, my friend Lisa Booth, who is absolutely awesome and fearless, uh, they had at one point maybe said that she could be there, but she was not vaxxed, so they wouldn't even let her in studio to, to audition. Uh, I guess I have a couple questions for you. Would you even consider the gig? And uh, what do you make of just what happened there? Or do you have any sympathy for someone like Alyssa? I suppose who's, let's say, maybe a little bit on more our side of things, but is what it is. No, I have no sympathy for Alyssa. She's a very silly person. She is an intellectual lightweight, and she needs to act like a grown woman. If someone is attacking you, then you need to know how to defend yourself. If someone mm -hmm. is steamrolling you for the purposes of humiliating you so that they, they portray to the world that your political views are somehow illegitimate, then you need to interrupt, and you need to do it in a way that actually interrupts, not not fluster and flap around like a like an agitated bird like she does. So no, I don't have a lot of sympathy for her. That being said, Sunny Huston is like a very mean person. She's a very yeah, nasty yeah. person. Um, so I, 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 if I were in Alyssa's seat, that would not be happening. But like I said, Alyssa needs to act like a grown woman and this wouldn't happen to her. 